G'day and welcome to the Heatzig Daily for the 15th of October. We're out to kill three sovereign officers and no one else. Uh, we're frail, we're shaky, we're ex glitcher, and we've got a glitch trap. We also have the cold fire, which is not the worst, but also not the best. Um, I mean, it's not like a liability, which the brick would be in this scenario, so I, I guess I can be grateful for that. Alrighty. Okay. Now, we want to go this way. If we can. There's our key. It's a terminal. Alright, sure. So we can dash like so. I'll take it, I'll unlock, I'll then dash up this way. And there we go. So the reason why I grabbed that sword is because um, I could then use it to dash away even though I clunked a fella. Okay, great. I'll definitely take this back and that. And yeah, so see there I clunked someone, but because I and so my con camera was on re what am I trying to say? Not recycle. No, oh, that's interesting. I could subvert that and leave, but I think it might just be better for me to get the item. I mean, I might as well set off the alarm, right? There we go. That's better. So you're gonna then come my way. You're explosive, so gotta keep that in mind. Let's just subvert that. Okay, bash you. Take this first, I think. Honestly, hard to say if it would have been better to take the key. Open this up, an emergency shield. Not the worst remote. Okay, so one thing to remember here is that I can't just blow them up. I'll take that, I'll take this, but I'll start by taking this and this and ducking down this way. I mean, I guess I could have glitch trapped the body, this, the target this way, but that seems silly. Really? Come on. Thank you. Now, there we go. What was that noise? Anyway, we killed one crew, that one crew is our target. Kinda wish that they didn't count as crew for 
stats there just because then I wouldn't be all worried that I had uh, violated things because you can see that it specifies an on-target there. Um, we'll dump the sword in the ship, I think. Uh, 40 seconds to escape. Everyone's got shields, that's good. Okay, 40 seconds to escape is not ideal, mind you. But that's okay, because we can use it to get more items. Okay, up we go. There we go, okay. So, routing would be this way. We've got enough subverters that we can just subvert our way through things. Just need to be careful not to inadvertently get ourselves or others killed. We're going to drop the long blade. We're going to actually drop the shotgun as well. Really? Okay. I mean, I don't know why I'm trying to be tricky here, other than I like the idea of subverting both at the same time. It's not actually a very clever approach. What we're going to do here is we're going to bash one of these guys, and then we're just going to turn on emergency shield. I should have dropped the other emergency shield. Oh no, oh no, 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 no. <laughs> that would have been bad. Kill ya. Take this. Hey. Right. Swap here. Subvert. Head down. Remote. Ah. Open. I might as well. Remote. Stop. Shoot. I'll dash actually. That was a terrible pickup. But that's okay. Alright, there we go. 12 seconds. And now we have that sidewinder. Oh, I should have just sidewound. Ah! <laughs> Bugs me mostly because I really should have seen that in the moment. That would have made the pickup simpler. Um, right, so yeah, this is just like get across the ship, um, subvert the uh, subvert the target or set off the alarm, subvert the telly, and then leave. All right, there's that heat sensor. Ooh. Okay, disable both heat sensors, uh, telepad, leave. Uh, wait, we got the cold drive. So this is actually like one of the few times where it's relevant. Oh, wow. Oh, I don't think I'd ever thought I would see the day where cold fire was relevant on a daily. Because heat sensors are so rare. And this just bypasses them completely if you remember to use them. And of course, I then managed to completely flub it. I mean, at least we only spent two seconds in the range of the ship, right? I guess... Ah! Right, because the thing is, right, cold fire dramatically reduces your uh, acceleration. So I actually was going too fast for cold fire to be able to work for me. <laughs> to slow me down. Uh, okay, right, so we want to subvert that and we want to leave, right? So that means that we start by going and dashing down here. I'm going to grab a shotty. Now you have teleporters, good. 
shotgun. Sidewind. Deactivate. Sidewind. Deactivate. Extreme range. Sidewind. Move up. There we go. We are done. Should have turned off the cold fire drive immediately. That was my mistake. Yeah, that I could have done. I spent too much time right near the ship because of the cold fire drive. If I hadn't had the cold fire drive, that would have taken me less time. Ironic. But cold fire was relevant, which is a first. Uh, there's no way I'm keeping first here. All right, DQ hasn't played. I mean, he might mess up. Uh, but yeah, and similarly, yeah. Like, there was no way I was going to keep second in that last one. Alrighty, I'll see you next time. Have a great one.